Hey guys, Matt here. Uh, due to popular demand, I am going to make one of my removal videos. That's where I uh, go ahead and pick an anti-malware program and pit it against an infected computer, a very infected computer. And a lot of people seem to really love uh, MSISoft's uh, anti-malware product. It is $39.99, uh, but they give you a demo, a fully functional, complete demo for uh, 30 days. So that's pretty nice of them. Um, from what I've heard, uh, tons and tons and tons of praise for this program. I have, I have yet to use it, um, but I am looking for new removal tools for my business. Uh, so let's go ahead and try this out. Um, I do have a very infected computer here. I infected it today with a bunch of zero-day malware from uh, some private sources. And um, I think it was five viruses, and then I just proceeded to search for things in Google like uh, Flash Player Download. And I, I clicked on, you know, an obvious bad ad and, um, oh, Acrobat Download and, like, free Photoshop and things like that. Things that you can find in Google Google search right now. <laughs> and I got tons and tons of uh, adware. Um, so we've got five known viruses. I don't I actually have no idea what they do. I just installed them. They deleted themselves except for this guy right here. It looks like a PDF, but it's not. Uh, so we're going to see how good uh, MSISoft's anti-malware can clean up this computer. And I'm going to show you in a few seconds how this computer is running. Um, why don't we try to get on the internet? So hang on a second. I gotta pause this because it's acting crazy. Okay, so I have it downloaded and let's take a look. We've got something in front of us right now is PC Pro Cleaner. They are a Microsoft partner, I'm sure. All right. MSI soft anti-malware setup. Let's see how big this is. 159 megabytes. It's pretty sizey. Looks like it's a 32-bit program. Um, and before it does run, and I can show you this later if it's too late, I wanted to kind of show you what happens with the PC right now when I try to get on the internet. It's pretty much unusable. And I'm hoping uh, MSISoft can just, you know, clean this up for me to where I can use this, this computer again. That's the whole goal. Get on the internet, use the internet without being bombarded with pop-ups and redirections and things like that. That's what that's what we're looking for. You can never be 100% sure that you are malware-free. The only way to do that is to format your hard drive, reinstall the operating system. But it is nice to get a PC back in working state. Uh, somewhat working state, so you can keep... keep uh, you know, troubleshooting it and what have you. So, so this is what I have right here. Tons of ads and pop-ups. Um, if I click an actual website, not an ad, let's go to shoes.com. Some nice shoes. All right, get a little shoes.com coupons okay ads appear now <laughs> more ads ads down here ads on the side ads over here ads over here it is terrible this is a really infected computer so let's go ahead and close that because we know we're in trouble uh, we're going to go ahead and do a test drive, 30 days free. Uh, no thanks. 
So I guess they give you little bits of news and alerts down there. It's going to download a bunch of uh, sig signature updates. Okay, and next it says enable pups detection. Yeah, we definitely need that because most of this stuff that we're seeing now is a, a pup potentially unwanted program. So. And from my um, my experience, they're always unwanted programs. Let me just say that. All right. Uh, we are going to go ahead and do a full scan. It is the slowest scan. Thoroughly scans all files on the hard drive. We're updated. We've got all our, you know, definitions updated. And let's go ahead and do a full scan, and we will pause the video while that runs. We'll find out. So... It is 4.55 right here. It's actually 6.55. That time is wrong. So we'll just go by that count. Okay, so the scan finished. Uh, it is 5.20 according to this clock. So around, what, 25 minutes? This is for a PC that has no other programs installed. It's just a uh, Windows 7 install with all the updates. And, I don't know, a few other small things, but nothing big. All right, so it came up with 54 detected, one high risk. I'm not sure what that is. And the other ones, according to MSI, are no risk. Oh, no. I wish I could organize by... Oh, there we go. Lots of high risk. Sorry. My mistake. So lots of high risk, and then some medium... And I would say the no risk are risks, because they're ad generators and... They can bring you to bad places and download bad things. So I, I would say those are all risk, in my opinion. All right, so we're going to go ahead and be safe and quarantine selected. Mm, you might hear some noise, some background noise. I, I am in a temporary room because um, my normal computer room uh, got a crack in the foundation and uh, flooded. So... I had to move everything very quickly. So this probably doesn't sound good, but <laughs> it's all I can manage right now. All right, so it left these. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do from here. I said quarantine everything. It's not asking me to reboot. Hmm. All right, we'll go ahead and say next. Not all the selected objects have been quarantined. Do you want to place them in the quarantine now? Yeah. Okay. Uh-oh. We're in some crazy loop. Okay, it's taking its time this time. Let's see if it does it. Cannot be removed. Okay, they want me to go to a forum to help me remove this detection. That's pretty weak. Oh, well, apparently I'm stuck on the screen. Hmm. I don't know. I don't. I don't get all the rage about this program. I, I thought I had like a new tool to really clean up some uh, stuff with, but I'm not seeing it so far. I have to exit. I mean, there's nothing else for me to do. It's just stuck on that loop. So let me go ahead and uh, reboot. And I mean guess I'll do another scan. I won't do a full scan. There's no reason I should have to do that again. Uh, so hang on. Okay, it is deleting some uh, stuff here in preboot. I just wanted to show that real quick. All right, well, we're back. And I just realized I'm not in full screen, but I don't really think I need to be. Unless you guys are really super hard of seeing or something. 
All right. Well, whatever. We'll go. So, again, this pops up. I've already said in the past I just want to test drive for 30 days free. So I guess it didn't remember that. I've already done all this. Okay, it's going to do another update. Yeah, I've, done already, I've already done all this stuff. I'll do a smart scan. Uh, some stuff that it did remove. Um, Windows is complaining that it can't find some adware. And uh, what else? We don't have too many more. Yeah, we don't have... Well, we do. Uh, PC Cleaner is still there. Stormwatch is still there. Hmm, I thought that stuff would be gone. Hmm. Alright. Let's go ahead and pause it while it scans. I don't want to keep anyone waiting. Oh my god, this is taking forever. I try to do a smart scan, but oh, I don't even know what it's called. Smart scan? I don't know, but it is taking forever. I need this to finish so I can move on to other th other uh, things in life here. So, come on now, hurry up! It's taking forever. I mean, I've been here for I don't want. It feels like forever, but I don't know. It's annoying. Okay, so we did a full scan. We did a, um, I think it's a recommended scan or something like that. Hang on. Hmm. Still have that crap here. Whoa, what's going on? Okay. Out of the way, PC cleaner. Whoop. <laughs> Hold on. Um, come back here, I'm sorry. All right. Okay, recommended. Smart scan. So we did a full scan and a recommended. So let's go ahead and see if we are able to use at least the internet again. Okay, we still have this crap search engine. And it's barely coming up. Try to go to Google. No. Now we uh, lost our internet connection here. All right. Hang on. Okay. So I am back. Apparently there was a proxy server that was still, um, I don't know, loaded on my computer. If I click that, you could see it, but that was checked. So I unchecked the proxy and now I can get back on the internet. Um, we're still being redirected to a lot of junk here. Hold on. Come on now. We've been cleaned. We can do this. Let's uh, do our search uh, for shoes. Um, that's how the internet loads with these scroll bars right now. Uh, PC cleaner is still there. Stop. <laughs> go ahead. Uh, let's go to shoes.com, see if we still get pop ups. Mm, so far, it looks. Oh, there's one on the left, one on the bottom left, right corner, right column, bottom, video playing. I don't know, I'm sorry. I'm not feeling it, guys. I'm not feeling it at all. <laughs> it looks like nothing happened at all to me. I mean, I'm not sure exactly what you guys removed. I'm, I see that you removed something, but you guys got a long way to go. Uh, I got redirections to some website. Yeah. Sorry, I don't think I'll be using this. Um, on my clients' computers. No. Sorry. Bye.